What's going on, people? It's your boy TJ Blaze. Y'all already know what it is. Y'all see your boy rocking the hoodie. Maximum Football 2020 is coming in September. Make sure you check it out. But before I get into all my news for the XFL, hit the like and subscribe button. Be right back. So yesterday we had some breaking news surrounding the XFL after going bankrupt earlier this year amid the COVID-19 crisis. But former WWE superstar Dwayne The Rock Johnson has just bought the XFL for $15 million. The Rock tweeted yesterday, with my trailblazing partner Danny Garcia and Redbird Capital, we have acquired the XFL. With gratitude and passion, I built a career with my own two hands and will apply these colossus to our XFL brand. Glad to see the XFL is coming back and with a successful owner like Dwayne The Rock Johnson, I expect some successful years ahead of them for sure. But where does that leave the gaming community, the sim community, the community that has been wanting uh, a simulation game, a football game for so long. I know a lot of you guys have probably heard about NFL 2K uh, possibly coming back, but I don't think that they're gonna have any type of simulation aspects in the game. I think it's gonna be really, really dry and archaic. But nonetheless, where does that leave our simulation community in terms of getting a real simulation game? Now that the XFL has been resurrected, we may see a video game coming pretty soon. So who gets the exclusive rights if they do end up doing this? Is there gonna be even any exclusive rights? We know that the XFL was very, very close to a deal with Maximum Football before they went bankrupt. I spoke with some of the leading developers at Canuck Play, the guys who developed Maximum Football, and they spoke in uh, high interest, especially with The Rock now purchasing or buying them out of bankruptcy. You know, that's gonna be really, really big. But at the end of the day, it's not really up to Maximum Football, it's up to XFL if they're even willing uh, to go with that merger. I'd like to bring in one of my insiders, Devin Jackson, on his thoughts uh, on the possibility uh, of there even being a maximum football slash XFL football game in the future. What's up, guys? I'm Devin Jackson with MGN Sports. Uh, so first, we're going to look at a, a report from uh, Sam Schwartzstein. He was a former director of operations for the XFL. Uh, and according to Schwartzstein, he had talks with Canucks Play about uh, the XFL and the Doug Fluey maximum football game doing some sort of partnership uh, and combining to make a game for the XFL. Now, essentially, the, the proposed game uh, for the XFL would have allowed the XFL to enter their logos, teams, player names, player data, uh, all those things uh, affiliated with the XFL teams. So that would have been huge for the XFL. But the key thing to note in both of these things is that it would have been something down the line for, for the game. Uh, it was not going to be something that was going to happen next summer, or the following summer. It's going to be something down the line, uh, something that was going to happen in the near future, but not the immediate future. Uh, so that's something to know when you when we were talking about making video games for the XFL. It was still a couple years away, still in, in a very, very raw stage. But there could have been potential before the pandemic canceled the XFL. Likewise, man, I think it'll be a big opportunity um, for Maximum Football and XFL to kind of do a merger for a video game. Um, anybody that thinks otherwise would be out of their mind. Think about the financial gain uh, from both franchises that Canuck Play and the XFL. I think Canuck Play is on their way up. And I think it'll be a great addition to what's going on, especially with so much going on with COVID-19. But I think right now, Maximum Football, the, the developers at Canuck Play can deliver a game um, right away. It's just up to the XFL if they want to do it. I'd like to bring in my other insider, Yuri, on his thoughts on how close we are uh, to an actual video game uh, in 2020-2021 with XFL being on the front cover. We had rumors and actual response to the fact that Doug Flutie's Maximum Football and Canuck Play were in talks with, M with the XFL. Right now, I believe we're very far away. I do believe Maximum Football is a viable, available option and see what we have, what Maximum Football has to offer for us. I'm 
money that I don't accept.